This is Pie Girl. It's a DIY retro Game Boy project. The Pocket Pie Girl is like half the size, but just as powerful with even more retro games. It's running RetroPie and FBCP to display graphics acceleration on this little screen. This is a really fun project. If you want to learn about electronics and the Raspberry Pi, you can do so by building one. We have a full tutorial on how to build this project on the Adafruit Learning System, so check that out. It's super fun. The Raspberry Pi A Plus is a small and yet adorable Linux computer. The Adafruit Pi TFT is a 320 x 240 2.4 inch display, and this is a really nice Pi hat that makes, well, a great circuit sandwich. For the controls, we're using tactile switches and a Permaproto PCB wired to a Pi cable. This is actually a lot better than having to hack up your Super Nintendo controller, so save that for another project. To power this one, we're using the Power Boost 1000C. This lets you charge your batteries while playing. We're gonna call that smart charging. 2000 milliamps of lithium gives you plenty of time to save that princess. How about that audio? 8-bit never sounded so good and crisp with this tiny Class D amplifier and a mini metal speaker. Speaking of small, our 3D printed enclosure is even smaller than the original Pocket Game Boy. So check out our Adafruit tutorial. You can get the parts to build this project from the shop at adafruit.com. Now let's take a look at some soldering shots. <laughs> 